Hey guys, on today's video I'm going to teach you how to reset your iPhone's back to factory settings. And it's the same thing whether you guys have a mini or a 12 Pro Max or just a standard 12 or maybe an iPhone 11. It's actually the exact same thing. We're going to go right into settings. Under your settings, you're going to scroll down so you guys see general. Under general, again we're going to scroll down and on the very bottom we're going to see reset. Once we press reset, we're going to see these options up here. So the first option will say reset all settings, erase all content settings. That's what you want. You want the second option that's going to delete everything, including the Apple ID on the phone. So maybe if you're thinking of selling your phone, this is exactly what you want to do. Erase everything from it. Put in your passcode if you have one. And from here on the bottom, you will see this message where it says erase iPhone. Let's just press on erase iPhone erase iPhone again. It has to do that twice because it's deleting everything. Pictures, information, your Apple ID, phone numbers, absolutely everything. We're going back to factory settings. So the very first time you guys set up your phone, you took it out of your box. This is how it's going to come out. Exactly what we're doing right now. So again, for most of you, you're doing this because you're giving this to somebody else. Maybe you're selling it. And um, again, it doesn't matter which iPhone it is it's gonna take some time to do this. So make sure you guys put enough time aside in order to do a factory reset. Right now we're just gonna see an Apple logo. Just let your iPhone be. And in just a bit, we should see an Apple logo plus a loading bar. That's gonna go pretty slow. Once it's done factory setting, we're gonna see this screen. Hello, we can swipe up and set it up again. You don't have to set it up right now because we can just turn it off and there we go. However, if you're selling it, I would suggest setting it up and just set it up without an Apple ID, which you can do and I already made a video about doing that, so make sure to check that out so we can choose English and go throughout the whole setup process. If you just want somebody else to set it up, then go ahead and press this button here on the side, which is your volume, your power, just hold on to them and we're going to turn this off. So to power off our iPhone, you're going to see this slide and we're going to just slide this. It's going to be off. That's how you turn it off. So right now, whenever we turn it on, it's going to be back into factory settings like we just left it. And that's it for this video. Anyways, if you guys have any comments, questions, you guys can write down here in the comments area. Don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.